All right, boys, welcome back. Um, really, not even not a bright day outside, and I'm looking at I'm looking back at these videos, and goddamn, dude, lighting on my face kind of sucks sometimes as I'm editing them. You know, I wanted to play Black Flag so badly, but I couldn't. The charges, sir, I'll hear them again. My lord, His Majesty's court contends that the defendants. Mary Reed and Anne Bonney did piratically, feloniously, and in an hostile manner attack, engage, and take seven certain fishing boats. Oh no. Secondly, this court contends that the defendants lurked upon the high seas and did set upon, shoot at, and take to certain merchant sloops, thus putting the captains and their crews That's so fucked up. Fear of their oh, lives. it's El Tibaron. And James and, Kenway, yeah. born of motley parentage in Swansea. To an English father and Welsh mother. Married at 18 to Miss Caroline Scott. Now estranged. She's a beautiful woman, I am told, but not at all well these days. If you touch her, you bastards, I'll... Quite a surprise finding you here rotting mm. in a Jamaican prison. We heard rumors that you had taken up with the pirate Roberts. If you know the observatory's location, tell us now, and you'll be out of here in a flash. Rogers can hold these British hounds at bay, for a time. But this will be your fate if you fail to cooperate. You, Mary Reed and Anne Bonny, are to Damn, dude. from hence to the place from whence you came. This game is nuts. to the place of execution, where you shall be severally hanged by the neck. Till you are severally dead, dead, dead. Oh, Ross. May God in his infinite mercy be merciful to each of your souls. Say it. pregnant. Yes. Do you all hear that? Yes. What the devil did she say? They plead their bellies, my lord. Aye, you can't hang a woman quick with child, can you? Can you? Back then. Quiet! Quiet! If what you claim is true, then your executions will be stayed. But only until your terms are up. Then I'll be up the duck the next time you come knocking. Remove them! She's gonna, dude. She's a fucking. She's gonna whore it up to stay alive. Never had to think about that as a lifestyle. Just to survive, just to stay alive in prison. What's your name? Four months later. So what is that? It's July. Walpole, where'd you get that? Well, that's the rumor going round. As dirty and daft a pirate as ever sailed these West Indies. They said Duncan Walpole. Well, whatever his name, gotta make sure he suffers without dying. Orders from the governor. I'm back to the prisons at sundown. And massage his feet if he's aching, hey. shall I? Quiet, oh, you stupid. Uh, I'm not sure what we're in. Ooh. Do this game and it's fucking. This is a warning. This game and it's like audio cues. If I what happens if I eagle vision? Get that guy in the back, dude. Get that guy in the back, come on. You can't even see him. You can't even see what's his name? Atabai! My my boy. Good morning, Captain Kenway. I have a gift for you. Freedom. That's what Do the gift is. Take my purpose here. I have come for Anne and Mary, and you owe me nothing for this. Ah. But if you would lend me your aid, I can promise you safe passage from this place. I'll need weapons. You are comfortable with this, I am told. We must hurry. I like that Edward's not being a total cunt to uh, Atabai. Visit old friends and sabotage bells. Bet, bro. Old friends? There's two of them? I know there's one. I'll have to, I'll have to re revisit. But yeah, dude. I like that Edward's not being a total cunt towards Atabai. Because, uh... He's like the only... And dude, everybody keeps telling him to throw in with the assassins. It's like, dude, of all the people, like... That haven't been total cunts to you... I can't believe like you're just throwing away their their valued friendship and partnership just for some treasure for the observatory. And the assassins want it for like, you know, this game's crazy, man. This game is nuts with its story. 
Oh, no, 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 no. Okay. Hey, as long as you ain't see that, I'm okay with it. Now we can sabotage this bill. Do you just gotta wait? Sometimes you just gotta wait. That's all it takes. Okay, we're going across the, the front side. There's probably something over here that I'm missing. You should be fired. Just saying. This dude should be fired right here. I can't believe he doesn't hear it. Doesn't hear me rustling through, the, ruffling through these bushes. Doesn't hear a goddamn thing. Yes. Come here. Like a dumb, trained animal. Come here like a dumb... Just keep doing your dumb course. That dude's gonna walk away now. I'm gonna go like this. This dude's going down a well. You know what's funny? Speaking of dumb, trained animals, that dude's gonna walk back here right now, just like he is. He's not gonna wonder where this dude went. He's just gonna, he's just gonna keep doing, Ooh, I'm just gonna keep doing my patrol. Cause that's what the king told me to do or something like that. The king, like the king specifically said to him. That yeah, your patrol is everything. You run this bitch. No, 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 no. Opportunity come a knocking. Cause now that dude won't be a fucking problem. I'm actually gonna go ahead and Pick up this fucking body. Oh shit. Bitch splash. Gravy all over my cash. Okay, well this guy's gonna go back. So I wonder if we can pull some some fuckery with him. That's something that I strive for right there is to be able to be that just coordinated with my life that was so well coordinated and planned out i just want my life to have that same way of carrying out i'm kind of not seeing with my old friends oh there's one there's one of my old friends i can't is that is that one of who do i think that is i'm not going anywhere near these guards just minding my own beeswax. This is you weren't much of a friend, Jack Rackham, nor an able sailor. Calico either. Jack, no way. But you were strange and lively, and you made me laugh more than once. And that's enough to make me sorry for seeing you like this. I hope you found a lasting peace down there among the dead. Because obviously he's going to hell, right? That's he's obviously going to hell. We gotta climb this bitch. Get a nice, like an actual, like a real viewpoint, like something like that, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Tweaking ass bastards. I'm planning this out perfectly. I don't see where my other old friend is, so I'm gonna just keep searching after this, but we'll start by doing this. Because that dude should be fired. He's a fucking dumbass. I know it's dark out, but dude, there's a light right there. There's a light right there on the bell. Alright, fuck it, dude. I'm going for it. You. Oh! That's not sus. Who? Who's sketchy, bro? Someone sketched out like over somewhere else, right? That's what that means. Got a whistle. That whistle and like go over to the very far corner. This is how you this is how you play games. You don't play games fairly, you exploit games. That's what gaming is. Oh, that's so fucked up. No. Just fall asleep, dude. Just fall asleep. Don't just mind your business. Go sleep in the corner. 
Fuck. Don't give me a fucking anxiety attack like that. God damn, bro. Alright. <laughs> That's three bells. Bam. You can take a nap right there with him, buddy. Yeah, eat shit, dude. Oh. Yeah, okay, get put down, dude. Ain't got time for your fucking games. I got optional objectives to get. I got animus synchronization to achieve. Um, I got stuff to do. So miss me with that bullshit. And then, who's my other friend, dude? I have another good guess. I think it's Charles Vane. Oh. No, it ain't Charles Vane. Who who could it be? I can't seem to find where this where this second uh, old friend is at. So instead, I think I'll just go ahead and uh, enter this bitch. And um, yeah, we're just gonna get in here. That was smooth, right? That's how you fucking get some trickery going. That's how you trick some bitches. I thought he was gonna fucking see me, dude. I thought that was it. I thought it was Christmas. You stop. Alarm! Help me, damn it! Ain't no alarm bells, you little bitch. Ain't no fucking alarm bells, you little bitch. I fucking sabotaged them all, dude. Alright, we're going straight in, boys. We need to locate our target. And this is also, yeah, this is a restricted area. Oh, that's, yeah. I knew uh, who that second prisoner was, and you can hear him singing that fucking song he's always singing, dude. We're gonna fucking fight, dude. We're fighting, dude. That's what we're doing, dude. Fucking A, man. Alright, I heard Charles Vane. Fucking bastard. Hello, Vane. I caught Vane because he discovered and brought here. So well. Didn't hear what happened after, though. Guides, Vane! Vane! Best of luck to you, mate. I wish we'd parted as friends. That's fucked up. That's mad messed up right there. So, I thought we killed him, but no, we didn't kill him. I just happened to remember the fucking... He, dude, he's... Yeah, he's fucking damaged in the head. Edward's beard always gets like nice and long, nice and thick whenever he's uh, stranded, but whenever he's wearing like this deserted outfit or whatever you want to call it, his shirt and trousers. Dude, I was just trying to play football, American football. Those dudes were ill, so I had to put him down. I, my name's the doctor. That's fucked up. Atabai is in here, dude. 
Did not know that. Finish him off, bro. Nah, I finish him. Don't worry. I got you, bro. Mary. Mary, it's me, Edward. Edward? Who's this fella? He's a friend. Sorry, Dan. He's a friend. <clears throat> What's wrong with Mary? She's ill. And her child. They took her. No idea where. Oh! 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 I know it pains, my lady, but we must be silent. Can you walk? I love Atabai, dude. What a good guy that dude is. Me, Mary. Come on. I can't. Search every cell. Come on, that's it. You're all right. This is so fucked up, dude. I might shed a tear, just a forewarning. I might cry. It's possible. Stop. Stop, please. I ain't leaving you, damn it. Lift your arm. Let's... <laughs> please, dude. I'm gonna fucking bust a manly ass tear right now. Dude, come on. Let's go. That's That's messed up. Don't die on my account. Go. This is such a pain in the ass. Damn it. You should have been the one to outlast me. I've done my part. Will you? If you came with me, I could. Mary. Dude, he squandered that fucking shit, man. I'll be with you, can we? I will. Fuck, dude. Told you this shit was gonna get good. People dying left and right. Let's fucking go. That's so fucking just sad and depressing. I didn't bust a tear like I think I was gonna bust a tear. I hope I don't have to put her down at all. I think I killed enough people to... We're fucking good, dude. And this is just so fucked up. Yeah, man. I said this was gonna get interesting and juicy and here we are at juicy fucking... Juicy and interesting junction. This is the entire town of Juicyville. God damn it, we are gonna have to put her down. That's so fucking. That's fucked up. Sorry, Mary. I'm gonna have to fucking fuck some dudes up right now. These people wanna fucking try and get me right now? These people wanna try and kill me? Dude, I'm never fucking Kenway, dude. I'm the fucking devil. I'm the devil of the Caribbean, bitch. I can kill you while I'm wearing fucking nothing, dude. I got you. I got you, boo. Even though, really, you're just my best friend. Yeah, man. What's happened to Mary? What's wrong? Is she gone? I know. What will you do now? Nothing sensible. You haven't earned this, but... They suit you. That's what I said. I said they fucking suit you, man. Good fortune to you, Edward. See, Atabai is a real fucking 
is a real class act. He's the real protagonist of this bitch. Edward Kenway has been nothing but a thorn up his ass. He's an assassin and he's fighting for freedom and shit, yeah, yeah, yeah. And Edward Kenway's been a total dick. Pretty much got, pretty much could have changed every outcome that has happened so far to his friends. He could have changed the fates of all of his friends if he had just not been so selfish. And dude, this story, man, is, is fucking classic. I love this story. This is such a good story. I said this at the beginning, dude. He was a selfish prick, and it took like three or four of his friends being killed for him to finally learn that, okay, yeah, I'm kind of a selfish asshole. This story is great. I love it.